Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to our video. In today's video, we're going to be checking out the brand new driver world update. This update has one new car and racing leaderboards. Anyways, let's get right into it. Okay, so there should be one of these little leaderboard thingies at every race. So here, I'm at the cross country race, and this dude has the first place time. As you can see, you can do it for time trial or exhibition. Basically, it just puts you on the leaderboard. I think there's 18 pages, and you'll get on the leaderboard if you have a fast enough time. Looks like the best car to be using here is the Koenigsegg Jesko High. Okay, so I'm in the dealership, and I'm gonna go ahead and take a look at the new Lamborghini Countach look-alike thing. Um, so here's the car. Okay, it actually doesn't look that bad from the rear end. From the side, it also looks quite like the car, but in the front, only thing I would change is the headlights. They're getting closer to what we want, but these headlights just really don't look good on this car. They need to try to do better with the headlights. I mean, I feel like what they had on that guard over there, those headlights were good, but... I don't know, this one's kind of weird. I feel like, hmm, I don't know, I really think they could have done better with the headlights. But besides that, this model looks okay. I mean, the roof scoop, eh, I don't know. The roof scoop sh should probably go, yeah, I don't know about the roof scoop. But besides that, I mean, they did okay. Uh, once again, the doors on this one are kind of weird. Um, they should be going up, but they don't. This thing has a top speed of 220 miles per hour. Uh, 0 to 60 in 3.2 seconds, and handling at 55%. It costs 2.6 million? Oh my god, that's a lot for this car. I mean, I feel like it should be a bit cheaper. Maybe like 1.5 mil spare for this thing. I don't know about 2.6 million. Um, one more thing I've noticed though. Every Lamborghini that came out has the same rims. I just feel like that's kind of lazy on the Voldex development team. I mean, I know that they got a lot of people working there, so I know that it's 100% uh, possible for them to make custom rims for each car. And I don't know why they're just using this one set of rims. I mean, it looks good and it fits with the car, but it's just kind of lazy that it's getting used on four different cars. Well, that's everything for today's video, I guess. I mean, this update's kind of tiny, a little bit disappointing. I mean, we got one mid-Lambo and a leaderboard. I don't know, not too special, but maybe next week's update will be more interesting. Anyways, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace. Racing.